After winning two on the road last week, Rainbow Wahine volleyball team held on to its number eight national ranking in this week's poll release today. Top five, Illinois, Cal, USC, Nebraska, and Stanford. I hope you're all having a pleasant evening. Eighth-ranked ladies won in five on the road at New Mexico State last Wednesday, then swept Lotek in Ruston on Friday. Tonight, Rainbow Wahine returned to action, hosting Notre Dame. Hawaii ended up sweeping the Irish. Emily Hartung dropped eight kills, hit 467. Brittany Hewitt, four kills, four blocks. Kelly Adolfo, two digs, two blocks, three kills for her. And Kanani Danielson, 12 digs with a match high, 13 winners. 25, 18, 23, and 17, tonight's numbers. Jane Croson added seven kills, 15 digs. On a home match, it's tomorrow night. Football now. At a time like this, everybody wants to point fingers. And as I told my team uh, after the game, uh, look in the mirror first and make sure that you did everything you're supposed to do. Same type of thing. You point your finger at somebody, there's a finger pointing right back at you. Committed six turnovers. Defense got six turnovers, including five on consecutive possessions in the second half. Guys like Richard Torres, Von Mayer Tonga, Kaniello Tui Pulotu, Aaron Brown, and Corey Paredes all stepped up. But UH head football coach Greg McMackin today still steaming a bit about the Warriors' effort on special teams Friday and their 28-27 road loss at San Jose State. Well, he had two more kicks blocked. That's six this season, including another PAT returned the other way for two points. That, that's unacceptable, you know, to have, have uh, kicks blocked. And uh, we're changing our scheme. We're going back to uh, an interlocking uh, uh, scheme that we, you know, uh, we obviously can't do what we're doing now. It was coming from inside A gaps, and we can't allow that. So we're changing personnel. Maybe a defensive lineman. May, it's going to be a tough, hard nosed mother that's not going to get pushed out of the way. I'll tell you that. Three and three Hawaii hosts two and three New Mexico State for homecoming this week. No team in the WAC has a winning record at this point. Number 78, that's former UH and Radford standout Wayne Hunter. Now starting right tackle for the New York Jets. Played well tonight on Monday Night Football, helping end their three-game skid by dropping the Dolphins. Terrell Revis, that's an INT off Matt Moore, returned it for a 100-yard touchdown. Mark Sanchez scored here on a five-yard draw, and he connected with Santonio Holmes for a 38-yard TD. 24-6 final, Miami's winless at 0-5. Devon Best, two catches, three punt returns in that loss for Miami. And the water's off Super Tubos today. And six to eight footers. Pro Surfing's Rip Curl Portugal. Ninth of 11 stops on the ASP World Tour. This is 17-year-old Hawaii rookie John John Florence. He advanced into round three. Had the best heat of the contest so far in round two with a 19.53 total out of a possible 20. Local boy Fred Potaccia advanced into the fourth round and so did 39-year-old 10-time world champ Kelly Slater. Hawaii's Dusty Payne here, also still alive, he is into round three as well.